Welcome back guys, I'm Zlevin, and this is the Goblin Starter Area in World of Warcraft Cataclysm, and I am almost back to the KTC headquarters to turn in those quests that I've been doing to get a bazillion macaroons so I can get off the goddamn island that Deathwing is trying to destroy. And I'm listening to the radio and my hot rod, and they're playing all kinds of crap. I thought they just played polka music, but it changes if you listen to it for a while, so that's cool. Let's talk to her first. Hey, stop moving. And she's saying these are worth a fortune. So, we turned in all the items that we stole from Gallywix. Let's see what Sassy has to say. We broke into our safe and got our money. And one of the items that we get is a bank robber's bag, so that's cool. Do I need any of this stuff? I know I need a better weapon because the one that I have sucks ass. And that is the goblin radio, by the way. They play a nice assortment of stuff. <laughs> Alright, so we turned in all the quests that we needed to for the money and stuff, so let's see what Sassy has to say. 447. We're close, but we still don't have enough macaroons. But I've got a plan. We're going to collect on the headquarters insurance policy. Hope you don't mind, but I filled the place with the leftover fireworks from your party. All you have to do is go in there and sabotage things. Might I suggest the faulty generator, the leaky stove, and the flammable bed? <laughs> then come back outside and use the control panel to send it in the gas spot. It's a foolproof plan. So we're going to blow this place up so that we can cash in on our insurance policy. You know, this game teaches you a lot of bad habits. <laughs> Don't try this uh, in real life, kids. You want to cash in on your insurance policy. You probably shouldn't blow shit up because if they find out, you're going to jail. So that's the defective generator. And the leaky stove. We're sabotaging shit. And the last one is the flammable bed. Why would you have a flammable bed anyway? Well, I guess if you have some gaudy ass pillows like that, yeah, I guess it is flammable. Drop a cigar on the flammable bed. That's awesome. So we need to get the hell up out of here. And we're gonna blow this place sky high. So, scroll out the old camera to maximum potential. And here we go. There's a gas spot right there. And there goes our place. I thought it was going to be a big explosion, but I guess I was wrong. Well, that sucks. But we set the place ablaze, so now we get to collect on our insurance policy. <laughs> the claims adjuster is already here. <laughs> this is nothing. You should see Bilgewater Port. The whole thing is going up in flames. Fine, fine. I don't have time to inspect this place. Here's the moolah from the Bilgewater Cartel's insurance policy. So, yeah, we already got our money. That was hella quick. Do I need any of this? Yeah, I'm going to take these gas-soaked boots. Okay, and now that we got done with that, let's see what Sassy has to say. Life savings. We've got all the moolah that we need. There's only one thing left to do now, boss. Get you to the Trade Prince's yacht. It's about to leave port. We're gonna leave. We're gonna have to hurry. Hop in, cause I'm driving. So I'm handing over my life savings to Trade Prince Gallywix aboard the Trade Prince's yacht on Kazan so we can get the hell up out of here. And yeah, I think we're about to leave, so let's see what happens. The Trade Prince's yacht is about to set sail. Everyone get to the dock, hand over the keys, boss, I'm driving. Just let me know when you're ready to go. So we talk to Sassy again, and we are off.
so <laughs> we made it, which is pretty funny. She was driving hella fast. She was better driving than me. It's, hate to say it, but it's true for once in my life. All right, so we talk to Gallywix and see what he has to say. Hello, sucker. Oh, Zlevin, it's you. What an unexpected surprise. And he's rubbing his hands together. Congratulations, you just made it. I see that you've brought me all that I asked for, including your hot rod. A bazillion macaroons couldn't have been easy to come by. I'm now the wealthiest, most powerful goblin on all of Azeroth. Too bad for you that I'm changing the terms of our deal. You're now my slave. Get below deck and take a turn shoveling coal. Next stop, Azjara. And yeah, he just chumped us. So I guess we were the chumps all along. That guy's a dick. Taking the fall for this one. You're the one who got us lost. What does it matter? Galley Whips is gonna have both our heads. Shh. Did you hear that? Captain, who are they? It doesn't matter. Our orders are to capture the Horde target at all costs. No witnesses. the shipwreck shore Let's see what this guy's doing gizmo what are you doing just sitting there don't you recognize who that is laying next to you gizmo that's Zlevin. he's the whole reason we're still breathing and not crispy fried critters back on kazan that's Zlevin. sorry doc i thought he was dead <laughs> stay back i'm gonna resuscitate him i hope these wet jumper cables don't kill us all That's all I've got, it's up to him now. You hear me, Zlevin? Come on, snap snap out of it. Don't go into the light. I don't know, my guy's not moving. <laughs> Get up, sucker. Oh my god. Alright, so he's saying it's up to me now, and once I complete the quest, I can stand up. So this is where you end up after that cutscene. And everything got blown up, the ship that we were trying to escape from, Kazan. We did escape from Kazan, but now we are at the Lost Isles, and we're on Shipwreck Shore. So that is pretty much the, the uh, end of the first part of the uh, Goblin starting area. I should probably uh, finish the rest of these up soon. But for right now, I'm going to go ahead and stop it here. Um, yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed the first part. So uh, let me know what you thought, leave comments, all that stuff, talk smack, and I will catch you all later. Until then, take care. <laughs>